Alright you guys, welcome back, this is Sasuke Wolf, and welcome to another Let's Play video on Destiny. This is part, I believe, four of the paths complete the Eris Morn quest. From our last video, our last uh, adventure, we actually had to do part of the urn, which is go and kill thralls and cursed thralls and alkalites and and such. You know, had to get those kills here and there. So today we are gonna go to the tower because we have to go and. Uh, turn in the urn we have to take it to uh, um, Ares and see what she wants us to do next uh, I believe after that we also have to go and kill certain um, knights or certain uh, certain enemy hives to uh, to take it to the moon or something like that we're partially there we're almost done but today we're gonna try to do a, a brief um, gameplay today i'm gonna still try to hit 15 minutes i don't remember what what the last one was but this time we uh we should be able to get 15 minute mark if not then i do apologize because i'm trying not to do long videos and i know most of you aren't really watching all of it but it's not a problem as long as i feel comfortable with putting it up then it's fine so with that being said um uh, while we're waiting, please check out my uh, channel, Game and Tonic. Uh, click on the link above right there, and please subscribe. Let me know what you think, and um, hopefully see we'll, we'll, we'll go somewhere with it. If you need anything, if you want me to do a, a walkthrough with a certain uh, bounty, then let me know, and then I'll try to do what I can to do it. But either way, um, yeah. All right, so I'm not going to bother going over there yet. Because I have some uh, engrams to turn in. We'll go ahead and um, turn in, talk to her, and see what she wants us to do next. You honor All right. the names of those so, who... we gotta turn this in. And then, uh. Alright, so. Let's turn all these in. Do 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 do. Find the hated and fill the right. with his ashes. One little, two little, three little pies. Okay, well, okay, she's singing to herself over here, and she's got a little rhyme going on. <laughs> it's a little weird. I've never heard that one before, but, all right, so we have to go get the Heart of Crota, um, and things like that, so let me turn these in. I'm not going to get anything. You guys should already know that. Anyways. Let's see what we got. We got a bunch of stuff going on here. So we got, uh, forget about that. Uh, kill Urzak the Hated in Earth Sky Watch during public events. All right, this is a little. This is what we're gonna be doing. Also, on top of that, we're gonna get these three done. So today we are gonna get the Eyes of Crota, Hands of Crota, and the Heart of Crota. So. These aren't that bad. They're, you just go on to patrol and you go and kill the um, the ones that you need to. And then we'll go ahead and get on this. So this shouldn't be that bad. So let's go ahead and get that done. And uh, we'll just run it. The next thing we'll do is we'll go ahead and head to... Um, well, yeah, we'll just go to patrol. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm kind of sick at the moment, so... If I sound kind of weird, then it's probably because of that. But anyways, uh, we'll go ahead and get to Earth and go on patrol right now. See, it's uh, it's telling us, come here, come here. It's like, yes, I got to go there anyways. I didn't even check to see if uh, Nightfall and the uh, Weekly were actually active. But anyways, <clears throat> at least we're getting these done so that um, we don't have to worry about them later. Because uh, once we get these quests done, then um, I don't have to do any of the other stuff, which is the bounties or anything. Because doing those bounties, I already finished it on my Hunter. But I could care less about doing them on my other ones. Because 
my main one is my hunter. It's level 31. I'm trying to get it to level 32, which I need about like almost 50 uh, shards, radiant shards. And uh, that's me playing, like, I have to play the raid all the time. But that's only for me to actually get the shards, uh, like, once a week. So. Alright, <clears throat> let's see what we can find. Um, we have to go over here first. So if we want to get one of them done, we have to get uh, the closest one so that we don't have to go back and forth. Because we can get everything done all in a heartbeat. So what I'm going to do is, if you guys want to do it this way, that's that's fine. Because this is the one way that um, I always did it with my other ones. Because it actually didn't take that long. The only thing that will take a while is to get that public event active. Um, that is something else that you have to actually wait for. You have to wait for the public event to actually occur. And uh, he will show up. Urzak will actually show up and you just kill him. He's an actual just big knight. Um, the last time I thought it was. I thought it was an ogre but actually it wasn't. It was a knight. So right now we just have to get it done. So let's go ahead and get that done. I'm gonna do a little time lapse from here to uh, the next uh, to the next area. All right, so I'll be right back. All right. So we are here where it needed to be. I'm just um, switching my um, my weapons at the moment. So once you get to this area, after you get to um, through that, you'll see this little guy sit here. So what you want to do is you want to kill him, and everything will start. This is where everything will occur. So uh, what you want to do is you want to actually be careful because they will spawn everywhere and that's who you want to kill so no uh, no 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 uh, get away See, this is the worst part of it all is to actually get through that once you've killed them then you don't have to worry about it but it's just getting through all them Need it. That's all you need to do is just kill that one, that one wizard, wherever she's at. There she is. There. She's dead. Now, we got the Heart of Crota done. Alright, so from here, I'm going to go ahead and um, quickly... Ooh, here. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and quickly do a, a time lapse again. And we are going to um, go to the next area, which I hope you guys know. If you're new and you're a, um, you're a new guardian to this, then uh, you're probably going to wonder, you know, oh, that's where they are. That's why they're sitting there is because they're part of the DLC map. And um, so, yeah. So if you don't see them because you don't have the new DLC, it's probably that's probably because why. So once, once you get the DLC, then you'll probably end up seeing them. So I'm not sure exactly. So... Yeah, but um, let me know if you guys need help. I am on the PS3, not on the Xbox, or Xbox One or PS4. Uh, PS4, not just yet. Um, Xbox One, I'm not sure, because I know uh, people want me to actually get Xbox One. So anyways, <laughs> I'm getting off topic here. Let me go ahead and fast forward, and then we'll get this done, all right? So we are here over at the terrestrial complex, and um, I gotta change something here because uh, I'm gonna need this. 
but uh, yeah, so what you want to do is um, once you get here, you should already know this by now from the new strike. Uh, you should already recognize the area. But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to like run right through this all. There's, um, they're just here just to um, be annoyance. And anyways, once you get up here, um, just kill everything that you see here. You're going to need to anyways because... Um, away from me because um more a lot more will actually start spawning pretty soon as you can tell there's already a hive and um it's like a little war going on over here let's go ahead and kill all these knights and uh alkalites really quick because we don't need them all right, so here we are. We got servant of the eyes, and there's the urn. So really quick, kill him. Don't need that. And let's steal the treasure. All right. Eyes witnessed your greed. Now this is where it ends up getting a little uh, tricky. So what I do is I always get over here to wait. And you want to look for the eyes. Eyes are actually, um, uh, it's, it's an alkalite. So, do that. Lock off that entrance a bit. There he is. Eyes. The eyes of Prota. And there. Alright. So we killed him. Uh, well, there's actually um, three eyes of Prota. Sorry. So anyways, you get the gist of it, um, it's just to kill that one left. So, let's see if we can actually just kill it really quick. There we go. Eyes dead. Now to the next one. Let's just kill these guys a bit. Don't need them anymore. All right, next one is in the Lunar Complex. Lunar Complex isn't that far off from here. It's actually just connected to the same, well, not to the same building, but to the same area. Um, so we want to actually do it. Also, we also want to try to see if we could get the, um, uh, the, the event going. Because the event has to be here in the Skywatch. And we're already at 15 minutes. So, ah, get out. Alright. Ooh. He dropped actually uh, heavy ammo for me. Awesome. Let's see, um, right here would be the. the um, whoa. No worries, you guys. I'm not gonna do anything. Right here would be the where the public event would be occurring. But right now, we are going to go ahead and head over to the next area. So I'm going to really quick do a little time lapse on this. We're going to speed it up and head over to... Wait. Enemies moving against each other. Okay. This is where uh should be coming around here. We want to wait until they start saying um, <clears throat> uh, Urzak is here. So I'm going to speed it up a bit. If not, then uh, I'll just continue on with it. All right. I'll be right back.
well that was interesting i hope you guys saw what i just did there um he did pop up it took me quite a while just for him to actually uh appear so from there you know i just grabbed the got the sword since i had it and then just wailed on him it took me quite a while for it to actually go down and then he just exploded randomly um it's probably just because the server was uh, uh too overran by uh, uh whoop, whoop, whoop. what's going on there kind of a little glitch there but um yeah so it's like too many enemies going on at the same time here and um it happens um weird stuff end up happening and i i know i probably like left a lot of engrams over there back there but um oh well uh they're not really that important to me at the moment right now we just want to get things done here and uh but we got we got it um so like I said the next thing whoa get away from me next thing we are doing is um, the last portion I believe is the hands of Crota um, but we'll see what happens it's down in this section right here if you remember in the darkness so we'll just kill all these guys off a bit it's not hard Come on, you guys. There we go. Alright, so if you look on your radar, there's one over here. He's a servant of the hand. It is the hand of Crota. So, boom. We disturbed him. See that? And then we're going to wait here. Because no one can get you from up here. Especially the Curse of Thralls. You don't want them coming after you. So, the hand is right there. There's the hand. And uh, let's see if we could try to snipe or try to get those cursed thralls. Nope. Let's see here. Where is he at? There we go. All right, and we are done. The hand of Crota is done. So we can actually head on out of here. Let's go back to orbit. And I'm sure this is gonna be about like 20 minutes or, or so so if so then I apologize but you know what we got it done we got all four things done the hands of Crota the eyes of Crota we got Urzok for the urn and we got I believe the heart of Crota I think I said heart already but no eyes heart hands and then the urn so that's four four stacked on top of each other if you guys want to do it that way awesome instead of going back and forth you should stack everything up figure out okay what section am i going to be in what am i going to be doing and you know so it'll be easier and then you get to actually get more if you haven't gotten an exotic bounty yet then it's even better stacking your bounties actually comes in handy for getting an exotic bounty so you can get an exotic weapon but that's up to you so but um that being said um because my recording is at 24 minutes about right now on my computer actually i'm looking out like recording and it's 24 minutes but um i'm sure it's probably like shorter to you guys because it's um because i i did my time lapse and everything so we should be able to have some more um we should have like less time compared so let's go ahead and uh turn this in and that would be it for this episode Let's see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here. You can have that. Now give me my next one. Take the urn to the moon. Alright, that's going to be the next one. But I don't need to do that one for you guys because... um, Yeah, because I don't need to do that for you guys. I already did an episode for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, check it out. There is one called Final um, Ares Morn Mission. And uh, it's on my, uh, I believe it's on my Warlock. So that you guys could see how to do that one. And uh, yeah, and that's it. Everything else is done. I don't have to worry about it. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. Uh, so this is the final episode, I would say, because it's uh, 
I've already done the um, <clears throat> uh, the the sacrifice for the urn. So you just have to check that that episode out. I will put it up. Uh, I'll put it down in the description below. Check it out. <clears throat> but I'll also try to put an annotation up here as well next to my Game & Tonic channel. Check uh, check out my channel for more. We I have more interesting featured videos such as uh, how to kill uh, uh, Zor or something like that. It's for the exotic bounty for the Thorn. So the very last thing to do for the Thorn. So check that out if you want to. But other than that, I will see you guys later. Just be sure to comment below. Let me know what you guys think. And then um, I will see you guys next time. All right. See ya.